Yay! You made it! You are at the last pace in 1108. And there's a train on there. So what does that tell you? Maybe at the beginning when you saw the train coming, you thought it was coming to hit you. The light at the end of the tunnel was a train trying to hit you. But no, the light at the end of the tunnel means you are practically done. And the train also tells you that you are on track to finish and that you have been well trained with your brain. You are smarter now. I guarantee you, you are smarter now at the end of Algebra 1 than you were before you started Algebra 1 because Algebra is a great exercise program for the brain that makes neural passageway connections. If you haven't seen my video on why do I have to learn this, go and watch that, okay? It's on my uh, homepage at the bottom, and I think it's also on the, uh, it's on the YouTube channel. Why do I have to learn this? I'll never use this. And, uh, but there's some really good brain science about why we do algebra. But anyways, you're at the end. Yay! In fact, on the back, when you're done, there is a certificate, and there is Mr. Lightbulb, okay, that uh, you have gotten to know throughout this course. This certifies that has successfully completed the required paces for Algebra 1. So you can write your name in there, cut it out, put it on the refrigerator, okay? Make your dad happy. This pace is kind of like a final exam. So it is going to review, you know how every pace had a section at the back that reviewed a little bit from all the paces? So this goes much, much more depth covering all the paces. And so there's no new content. It's all review. So hopefully you held on to your paces from the beginning and you can go back and refer to them. You'll have the videos on Pace Success website that you can go back and look at if you're stuck. And um, you're just working through the different sections. There's still checkup, self-test, and then the pace tests. In a way, the pace test is like a final exam for the whole course, okay? So you're re reviewing things that you have been learning. And again, that's a good learning technique. It helps reinforce and solidify what you've learned. But this will uh, lay a good foundation, this whole course. And uh, next year, when you move on to, well, I guess next year you do geometry and then uh, the following year, Algebra 2, and they'll go back and do a little review before they start and then take into some new concepts in Algebra 2. So my goal is um, to start making videos for Algebra 2 and uh, see how far we get with that over the next several months. So we'll see you there, but you're almost done with Algebra 1. Hang in there, finish strong. Good luck.